All right, we are back yet again. Same day, different airplane, different video. It may be the same week. It might be a different week. I don't know. We'll figure out how it works. But we got the big horn regardless. And the big horn, it, I mean, we did the build, not really, I don't want to call it a build video. We did the putting it together video because it's plug and play. Fairly simple to put together. Still, at the RF esque you still had to glue the rudder and put the piece, some bit pieces there. Yeah, so the, you know, right now it's on pre order for 249 I think plug and play with flaps, this configuration here specifically is going to be about 299 bucks, receiver ready. But everybody that's flown this or seen it fly has been pretty impressed. So we've got quite a few people. We've got John, Luke, Wes, Donnie, everybody's going to fly it or try to fly it. And yeah, I've then, never flown this one yet. Well, he's never flown it, so he's going to fly it and see what they think. So that's literally all this video is about. If you're not subscribed, click the button, subscribe, and let's go fly an airplane. See, now is when you just throttle it up, not just chuck it. Because <laughs> that'd be cool. He's very tall, so I could fly. Cool yeah. that, that <laughs> Blew the canopy off the edge. <laughs> It needs a new prop. No, that's fine. We just need to balance it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we had a lot of fun with the Bighorn. We've done other videos with the Bighorn, some talking about it, some just flying it. So this one was kind of, we wanted to do some kind of review video where we actually I flew really it. Like easy Everybody will gets to get, you know, I even flew it. I haven't flown an airplane in a year or two. So that was pretty cool. Yeah, don't, don't look at a broken prop. <laughs> I mean, we own it. So, you know, don't run the battery down. Or else it uh, it comes in for a landing pretty Fixed. quickly. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, magically. <laughs> so I mean, really though, what what's everybody's thoughts? I mean, so even with the 3S, because I've only flown it 4S all the way up until now. Even with the 3S, I was kind of surprised that it would still hold a hover and uh, very manageable. I mean, it was, so that was a 3S just now. That was a 3S. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So well, holding the hover. That's, that's all Donnie would trust me with. <laughs> 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 and this is my first time flying it, and I just flew it around so you gave some videos. Yeah. But um. You know, just slow and steady. I mean, it was fine. It's very, lock, it's very lock solid. And one thing that we noticed earlier is that these airplanes, either inverted or upright, it really, it actually locks in just as easy inverted as it does upright. So that's, that's uh, very different for a uh, high wing airplane. It's usually inverted. They're a little squirrely, but yeah. you know, this one really likes, you know, the inverted stuff. And I mean, the wind's picked up pretty good now too. Yeah. Yeah. And you were, you were holding it in the hover. Yeah, for, I mean, I was able to go around until it landed. Yeah. Landing. <laughs> <laughs> it's coming in. All right. I mean, other than that, we'll, we'll call this one good. We'll, we'll quit talking about the Bighorn for a little while. Let you guys get your hands on it, see how you like it, and then we'll watch your videos. So otherwise, subscribe if you're not. Appreciate you watching, and catch you on the next one. I don't he's, yelling, he's, yelling, he's yelling from the other side over there. <laughs> we got a prop. Do you need it? Huh? We do, do you need the prop? <laughs> uh, I love you.
these guys.